Chris and I'm the creator of Alice Monroe. I've been playing games ever since I was a little kid really and slowly that interest in playing games also led to an interest in making games. So over the years I had all these ideas for games, I kept track of them in my little black book and I was really hoping that one day I would get the chance to actually realize them into my own game. I always wanted to make something that's like really story driven and challenging and like bone chillingly scary. But all my ideas they sort of revolved around open world scenarios. But then I realized there is actually a pretty simple solution to this problem. I just gotta take these ideas and set them in a more restricted and intimate area. Plus the fact that I live in a house that creaks and cracks at like the slightest bit of wind and has a distinct atmosphere of horror when it's dark at night really inspired me to set the game in a house. I think it would be fun to share my progress online, um, to basically share the experience with other people to see how easy or hard for that matter it is to actually make a game. You know, I know that there were many horror fans out there like myself, but I gotta say like um, the response I got to my post was staggering and fairly unexpected. Uh, pretty incredible though. So, you know, I thought maybe this game could actually become more than just a one-man project. So I started putting together a small core team, a um, couple of programmers, an animator, um, sound design and music of course, and off we were making Alice Road. Silent Hills was cancelled and amazingly like, people started calling Alice in Road the spiritual successor. Um, I have to say the response we got from people from like all over the globe was pretty humbling and incredible. I wanted to make sure that the look of the game was as realistic as possible because I think it really helps um, to get the player to feel like they're actually there. At the same time we actually spent a considerable amount of time uh, just on the narrative, working on the story and fleshing out the characters so that we can make absolutely sure they feel like real people like you and me. Alice in Road is a passion project for all of us. We want to make this game but we don't just want to make a game, we want to make a great game, you know. Um, as you know, the story starts off rather simply, but then it gets more and more psychologically challenging as time goes on. Um, we want to make this like a real survival horror experience. I like to call it actually an experience rather than just a game. Um, we're pretty sure it'll scare you like, just like the old games used to. We as a team have been working on Alice Road for quite a while now actually. You know, our supporters on the various social media platforms like Facebook, Twitter, etc. Um, they kept suggesting that we should try some crowdfunding. Um, they would really like to support the project. And we were like, actually that's a great idea because that way we could hire more people, you know, get the game done in a reasonable amount of time and at the same time we can add the level of finish that we really want to see in the game. So here we are, starting a campaign that we really hope shows our commitment and passion for this project. And please have a look around and please pledge if you would like to be a part of Alison Road and if you would like to come on this journey with us. Thank you very much.